So I just wanted to wish you guys the best of luck before I took off. Wait, Jared. Don't go, please. Just wait a second. I'm sorry, Whitney, but um, I listened to you once before. No offense, but I should have followed my gut back then. No, I don't think so. If you would have left before, you never would have fallen in love with Teresa. You never would have asked her to marry you. Exactly. You don't understand. I, I think this whole thing is my fault. What are you talking about? Well, I was all crazed believing that you were cheating on me. I must have got Teresa thinking suspiciously, too. You know, all my doubts and fears must have just rubbed off on Teresa. Now, I know that you love her, Jared. Don't go, okay? Give her one more chance. Oh, whatever you said or did doesn't matter. Ethan's got into her. He, he's even convinced her that I'm not, I'm not fit to be around her son. What? Uh, that's crazy. Yeah, well, it, it is what it is. But uh, there's really nothing we can do about it. Well, you know what? I think there is something we can do. Now, just give me a second to get dressed, and, and you're going to come with me, okay? No, 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 I'm not going to do this Teresa, again. Come on. No, come Ethan, on. no, we're not going to do this. No, Teresa, we're not going to do this. I know no. it's wrong, but I want you. I you know what? I want you, Ethan. I do. I want you. I want a life with you. I want a real, honest-to-God, legitimate life together, okay? I don't want this sneaking sex every time we find ourselves alone in the same room. It's more than sex, okay? You I know what? Want... Jared was offering me everything that I ever wanted to have with you. A marriage, family, security. You're not going to give me that. You're never going to give you me don't... that, Ethan. Never. So why would you take away my chance to have that with he him? He's not the guy you think he is. He's got a past. He's trying to... I know damn well he killed J.T. Cornell. Okay, do you have the proof? No, but my instincts are fine on this, Teresa. Okay, all right. You. And how many times have you told me that you can't stand to see me with another man? I don't like to see you with another man, all right? I love you. I don't like to see it. Then what do you want me to do? Do you want me to spend my entire life all alone so I can be available to you for hot quickies? Uh, is that Teresa, what you want, Ethan? On. Because that is not love. That is selfish. Is that what you want? You want me to spend the rest of my life alone so that I can be available to you whenever the mood strikes you? Because that's not love to me. That's not love to me either. No, I don't want that. Then why are you doing this? Why are you taking away my last best chance at happiness with a man who really loves me? Did you forget something? As a matter of fact, I did. The woman I love. Come back to get her. 